All right, what's up, squad? It's your boy, Tech Raj, and I'm back for more of these Ultimate Team Legend reveals. And I gotta say, man, I've played, I played Mutt for like two or three years now. And I don't, like, was it this fun last year with like a ratings reveal and stuff like that? Because I think this is pretty awesome and it's a cool way to get a setup for the season. But anyway, on your screen right now is a legend that I didn't add in yesterday, not because I forgot about him, but because I didn't actually have his ratings and I still haven't been able to find them. If, and it's actually this Bruce Smith card right now. Now you see the overall rating, but we haven't seen the actual ratings, or at least I haven't, either on the Mutthead Twitter page or on the official Mutt page. So if you do have his specific ratings and you've actually revealed them, go ahead and hit your boy up on Twitter at TechRajGaming.com, but moving right along. Oh man, the Nigerian Nightmare. It was exactly who I thought it was yesterday. The card that we saw from yesterday that we had to do the uh, 1,000 retweets to get, it was number 35, Nigerian. Actually, I thought he was a halfback, Christian Okoye, who is actually at 92 overall. So this is a badass card. First of all, let's go ahead and see some of the ratings. He only has 81 speed, he has 85 acceleration, 94 strength, 95 stamina, 97 truck, 97 stiff arm, and then a 92 bar carry vision with a 96 carry. Listen, just, just because this guy exists, and if you saw the players that I wanted to see in Mud 16, I am gonna, this is one of the first legends I think that I'm gonna go after, and I'm super excited about him. So, Right after that, the legend that they revealed after him was actually number 86, Brian Finneran, wide receiver for the Atlanta Falcons. He's a 91 overall in the 2002 season. I mean, he had a pretty B season. Now, a lot of people were getting all upset about Brian Finneran being one of the legends, but if you did play Madden 2003, or 2002, it's one of the ones where Vic went off big time, and I think it's a 2002 one. It was like Vic was the cheesiest Madden quarterback of all time, he was super fast, had crazy throw power, and one of the receivers that you saw always chunk it up to was Brian Finneran. Now he has 87 speed, which is pretty weak, but I don't think, I think speed's gonna be a little different this year, so I guess that's good. But he has 92 acceleration, 97 jump, 95 catch, 96 catch in traffic, with a 93 spec catch, and a 94 release. I don't think speed's gonna be that big of a deal this year because of all the playmaker controls that you're gonna have while the ball is in the air. Anyway, going back to that Christian Okoye card, if you know Christian Okoye, he has huge highlights, but one of the big highlights that he's associated with is whenever this next man, Steve Atwater, laid a hit on him that was heard around the world. So, his card is 92 overall. This one is specialized from 1990. Uh, this, this base legend, Atwater, has 92 speed, 90 acceleration, 90 jump, uh, and then as far as uh, 95 hit power, which is nuts, 90 play rec, 85 tackle, uh, and then 87 zone coverage is pretty good. Only 90, uh, only uh, 70 man coverage, but that's never that big of a deal. So, so pretty nice card. Of course, Atwater is ultimate legend, probably the best free safety in the game. Uh, but he's pretty good there. Then, you know, I always talk about, you know, I talk about Christian Okoye being one of my favorite cards, but this quarterback right here, who I don't think has gotten a lot of mutt love over the years, but is one of my favorite real life quarterbacks of all time, and that's Randall Cunningham. So, 92 overall card, which is, goes right inside with everything he's always like been and what his cards have been. He only has 88 speed, which is a little disappointing. 86 acceleration. Let's talk about his quarterback stats though. 95 throw power, which is pretty good. Uh, 91 throw accuracy. And then 94 throw on the run is pretty good. It is, his throw accuracy deep is a 93. And then throw accuracy short is gonna be a 90. Now as far as his running stats, he has a 90 juke move, 88 spin move, and then 84 ball carry vision, which is pretty good. After that, we had Rod Woodson. I mean, we've had Rod Woodson over the years, but the cool thing about this year's is that he is actually in a Raider uniform. So my boy Toke Nasty is gonna be happy about this one. 92 overall, 92 speed, 93 acceleration, 93 jump, and then let's talk about defensive stats. 87 hit power, 91 zone coverage, 82 man coverage, so very good coverage-free safety, of course, 
He also played cornerback early in his year, in his career, so that's not that surprising right there. And he has some pretty good kick return stats as well. He's 90 kick return. Uh, after that, we had Walter Jones, tackle for the Seahawks. The first time the Seahawks went to the Super Bowl, uh, he was a big reason for that. Uh, especially, you know, Sean Alexander was an absolute beast back then, and Walter Jones was a big reason for that. Anyway, he has 95 strength, 92 run block, 97 pass block, 92 impact blocking. So a pretty beast left tackle right there for you guys. Now here's another one, Ty Law. Uh, I know this Ty Law card is from 1998, 93 overall. But my biggest memories from Ty Law is always going to be from those Super Bowl years, specifically, um, I think the first time that the Patriots went to the Super Bowl, or not the first time, it was the one that, that, that the Patriots went and played the Eagles in the Super Bowl, because I remember, I think that was 2003, 2004 season, uh, because I remember Ty Law just freaking owning Peyton Manning in the playoffs that year. But he has uh, 90 speed, 93 acceleration, 90 jump, uh, 92 play rec, 97 man coverage, 93 zone coverage, and then 93 press. So he's gonna be pretty beast. Only 5'11". But let's see. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how. I don't know how height is gonna matter or if it's gonna matter this year. I don't think it will. And then finally, um, well, not finally. We still have two more. That I'm gonna show you. But we have Derek Brooks, 93 overall. You know, a lot of these legends we're seeing the same thing. Derek Brooks, which was, was an awesome uh, coverage linebacker here in past months. This one is 93 overall. Like I said, 89 speed, 94 acceleration, 93 hit power. 94 tackle, 93 play rec, and then 89 zone coverage with 80 man coverage. So I mean, this guy has like free safety, strong safety um, stats right here, which looks pretty good, which looks pretty good. All right, then the last card that they actually gave us a full review at the time of the making of this video is Herman Moore. I think this is the first time that he's actually in Mutt ever, which is pretty good. Herman Moore is 6'5". 65236. Shout out to the All Lions squad that's going to be made out there with Megatron. He has 93 speed, 94 acceleration, 94 jump, 97 catch, 98 catch in traffic with a 95 release and a 93 spec catch and 89 route running. Man, this Herman Moore is going to be an absolute beast. Very, very excited for this one, um, as well as you should as well. Hey, I'm getting kind of excited, man, with these legends that we're getting. So a lot of really good options right here. Plenty to get excited about. I think we have more legends to be revealed. And speaking of which, this is the last one that they told us that we need to go out there and get. So make sure that you're going to the official, uh, the official uh, Madden Ultimate Team Twitter page because we need to get the retweets for this one. This is the one that they're gonna reveal tomorrow or whenever we get the retweets for it. 94 overall running back. Now somebody asked the official Twitter page of Madden Ultimate Team if the amount of retweets that they asked for actually matter or is it just a coincidence? And they responded with, okay, then why don't you go ahead and make it 2100 likes so that we can get you a full reveal, which I guess the 2100 coincides with their uniform number. So whoever this player is, we think his number is gonna be 21. Now I saw a couple guesses, you know, we aren't really exactly sure, but guys, this looks like LaDainian Tomlinson to me. And I'm hoping it's LaDainian Tomlinson because LaDainian Tomlinson was one of the people that you guys responded to me on who you wanted to see in Mutt. So in the comment section below, let me know who you think it is. What do you think about these legends that we've seen so far? If you got that Bruce Smith stats, somebody tweet them to me or just give me the, you know, the stats here in the comment section below. If you're liking the Mutt 16 player reveal, legend stuff like that, go ahead and give us a like, subscribe if you're new, but most importantly, take care of yourself, peace. And runs it, but we're not gonna panic. We're not gonna panic. We gonna truck through somebody and any Lacey's off to races. You know, we could turn on the Jets, but nah. Where, where's that stiff arm? Where's that stiff arm? Eddie Lacey is back. What's up boys and girls, it's your boy Tech Rods and I'm back with some Madden 16 Ultimate Team news. And specifically this week, EA has been releasing what legends we are going to have at launch. So let's get right into it. 